I think one of the most underreported stories of today's uh, world is incarceration in the United States. The United States imprisons more people than any other country in the world, including the former USSR, more than China, more than any Arab nation, more than Israel, more than any nation in South America. All over the world, we imprison more people than anywhere else in the entire world. And what does that mean? What, what are the questions that surround that? We also have the biggest industry of private prisons in the United States. People are building prisons and making money off of locking people away for extraordinarily long terms. And I think this is the most underreported story in the United States right now. What happens to people when they commit a crime? What happens after they've been through the adjudication process when they're serving their time? In Vermont, we have facilities that are built to hold hundreds of people and now they're holding thousands of people. So many people, in fact, that we have to warehouse and we have to ship them off to Tennessee. We have to ship them off to Arizona. All these places. And this is supposedly in the Green Mountain State, the land of maple syrup and, and nice fall foliage and skiing and and all those nice things. What does it mean to be locked up in the United States right now? I think that is the single most important thing that people aren't talking about.